Alright, geez, here we go. So you dropped into town, and you're like, what the hell is going on? I mean, you could just go and explore all this shit on your own, but then you wouldn't be watching this video, would you be? Alright, so here we go. This guy is the Burnet Chief. As you can see, top left corner right over there, you can see it tells you what he did. He'll tell you some shit. You wanna, you'll be chatting with him first. And then the next thing is uh, this cute little gal right here. Her name's Bernagal. <laughs> She's just some gal from Berna, which is the city that you're in. Over here, this is your house. You can go, see? Go to your house. And you can go to your house by pressing the A button. Here's the Berna market. I don't know shit about that yet. But hey, look at this over here. The Manville Smithy. I don't know if this side of the town is called Manville or whatever, but maybe that's just his name. Who knows? And this guy does armor. He's the Berna armor. Now over here, this guy is the master of style. Let's see what he has to say to us right now. You're back, starting to get the hang of the hunting. Styles and hunter arts yet? Yeah! Judging from that dopey look on your face, I'm guessing. <laughs> F*** you. Sorry. Sorry, children. Tell you what, just walk yourself over to the quest counter. Pick the training quests, and then weapons, styles, and hunter arts that should get you started. Okay, that's the whole point of this video right there. Bam! I'm so glad I came over and talked to the master of style. He's so stylistic. Anyway, the point is, is that that's the point of the video. Training quest. Do one of those, and I'll show you the ropes all gentle like. I promise. I, he is pretty gentle. <laughs> well, I think I'm done explaining the basics. Isn't this a gift for graduating from the ranks of noobdom? Oh, well, there you go. He gave me some meat. Meat from the master of style. Gentle and rough all at the same time. See this? This gateway right here, that's where you go when you got a quest. How do you start a quest? Well, come back over here. I'll show you. You talk to the old Bernie gal and you say, What's up, baby doll? You got some errands for me to run for you? Yeah. The v eh. Not as cute as you. Wait. You want to make turn the animals into stuff? You gross, girl. All right, just give me the quest, man. All right, here's all the questing action lined up for you today. Now, it says I have no hunter art equipped. I don't know what that means yet. So anyway, training though. That's where you're gonna want to go. Training right here and uh, hunter basics. So these are the basics you want to do. So for instance, hunter training. This is just the straight up basics. And what's the main objective? Just to deliver some steak. The whole point of that is to learn how to cook food for yourself because you obviously don't know how to cook for yourself, do you, you little child? Still got mama doing it for you and shit. Here, you're going to learn how to combine freaking, you know, the herbs, like I was telling you in the beginning. But there's more to it than that. There's also mining and fishing and transporting because you're going to pick up eggs for whatever reason. That's going to be a quest. And you're going to want to know how to pick up the egg and just take it all the way back to camp. Well, that's what that's for. Anyway, and then slaying. This is a good one. So you're going to hunt a great Macau right here. Which if you've been playing the demo, there you go. And then capturing. So there's a difference between slaying and capturing a monster. And depending on the quest, you'll either be slaying or capturing. Or you have the option of doing either. Now... I'll just run through some of these. So we're going to go to the basics. We're going to select the quest. We're going to make baby girl right here all proud. Thick as she is. That girl's so thick. Look at that. Mm hmm. And she's also pointing in a direction. That means once you get the quest, a little green. There you go. I don't know what the green means. You might have a red one, but who knows. All right, let's go. Hunter training to basics, so he's going to walk you through all kinds of shit. We'll do this first one, and then you can do everything else on your own. But this is just so you get a little introduction. Oh, what a nice chest. I love that blue color. Living the hunter's life. Hey, it's me. You know, the world's greatest hunting instructor. Today, I'm going to teach you just what it takes to be a hunter. It ain't going to be easy, but you'll thank me later. And rightly so. You don't look too shabby in those old duds I gave you either. 
Make sure you treat them well. Your equipment can decide whether you live or die before you even start a hunt. He gives you some equipment there. So don't worry about having to go buy something or you know what I mean. Just do the training. Just do the training. Total over to that box. Got it. And then, of course, that's what you do. But yeah, look it. Don't worry. By the way, you got 50 minutes. So he, he decks you out. He, he gave you some armor and some weapons. See? Ain't got to worry about nothing. Bam. You so cool. Yeah, you are cool. Well, maybe not as cool as me. But hey, you'll get there. So there you go. It's pretty straightforward. You select an item and press a button. Take item. So there you go. You got to sheath, though. You got to sheath, and then the little A button pops up. Bam, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Nice work. You examined the snow and a supply box. <laughs> hmm. You want to know how to use all your other items, too? <laughs> Good question, but... And this is the point of this video. Those hunters stumble that run fast. Now, who was it that said that? Anyway. Just keep your leggings on, and I'll explain it all in due time. You know how when you open at the start menu that there's a flashy column that says advice? Enough talk. Time to put what I taught you to use. Open your map and get going. Anyway, this video's kind of going on too long. So he's going to walk you out. Look at that. Whoa. That dino's just cooling his belly off. Let's go for it! Looks like you've made it to the monster in one piece. Nice work. Start by pressing the X button, since that's how you unsheathe your weapon. Once you've got your weapon in hand, you can attack monsters with the X button and the A button. Right now, it's enough to just get used to attacking, but once you get the hang of it, you want to try out different combinations and moves of commands and commands. But enough talk. Hunting season for you starts right now. All right. <laughs> Not bad for someone who didn't even know how to open the supply box a while ago. You've still got some carving to do. Carving can provide you with everything you'll need as a hunter. Hunters have to live off all sorts of monster materials, so don't be afraid to take all that you need. All right. So, he's going to die. I'm going to sheathe. Once he's done twitching and shit, <laughs> I'm going to go over here and sneak up. Oh, sneak up and take his meat. Uh-oh, this bitch better not knock me over. Got some raw meat. Hmm. The thrill of the grill. That's some fine carving you've done there. But your objective is to deliver a well-done steak, right? Raw meat's not going to do you any good. We got to cook it and turn it into a well-done steak. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm about. Mouth is watering. You'll need a special item to cook raw meat. Now, if you really did take everything out of that supply box earlier, that's why you got to make sure that you take everything out. You should have ended up with a portable spit. That's what we're going to use to cook that juicy raw meat and make it something edible. So let's make that well-done steak a reality now. Piece of, uh... Steak, I guess. Yeah! Oh, I'm gonna take from him one more time. Just in case. Now, run over here. This looks like a nice spot. Got some light on the subject. Now, I'm gonna hit the L button. And then I'm gonna. So basically, Y is left and A. Anyway, there you go. Portable spit. Got it. Now, I think the moment you use this. There you go. The Chef's Secrets. Now here's where the fun starts, and you can try your hand at cooking meat. You can't eat raw meat, but what you can do is put it on the fire for a bit and turn it into a nice, delectable, well-done steak in just seconds. Crazy, I know, but stay with me here. Now it's time to get your hands dirty here. Use the portable spit when you have a slab of raw meat in your inventory, and a catchy little jingle will start playing. That's your cue that the cooking process has started. Timing is everything at this stage. When the music ends and your meat changes color, 
quickly press the A button to lift your meat off the fire. If you time it really well, you'll get a well done steak out of it. Now you give it a try. Be careful, if you pull it out too early or too late, you'll wind up with a rare steak or a burnt meat. Worst case scenario, you'll have wished you've never cooked it at all. <sighs> So time it well and take your meat off the fire at just the right moment to get a well done steak. All right, let's see what's gonna happen. Did you see it change color for just a bit? Yes, that's what I like to see, perfect. You'll be delivering the steak you just prepared, but normally you want to select one from the item bar and eat it by pressing the Y button. Filling your stomach will raise your stamina and limit it. Lim anyway, now that you've got your hands on that well-done steak, it's time to complete your quest and deliver it. For now, just hold on to it and make your way back to base camp. Do not, I repeat, do not eat it. Got it. He has his stomach set on that meat. But anyway, let's see this. I'm going to show you what it looks like to overcook it. So look at it. It's pink. It's pink. The music's still going. Right there. See it change color? Oh, then it went too far. Shit. Now, what you don't want to do is also this. Hold on. I got to get some more meat. Once he's done writhing on the floor, I'm going to carve him open. Sorry, buddy. Training purposes. Don't take it personal. <laughs> All right. So, oh, wait. Let's get another one just in case. Oh, I got to hide. Okay. Well, anyway. So, I didn't get any meat. Let's go get meat from this guy then. What's up, bro? Oh, wait. That was your tail. Sorry, guy. Any moment now. Nice and easy there. Got him open. There we go. Alright, now, I'm going to show you what it looks like if you try to hit it too quickly. Because you'll be thinking, oh, right when the music ends, I'm just going to hit A. Uh-oh. That was too fast. But if you notice... I'll show you one more time because you got to look for that color change. Do 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 do. Right there. Did you see it change color? Right when you see that color change, bam! Hit that A button. Now, since we got one, well done steak. How many do we have? We have two, right? We can eat one. Oh yeah. Look at that. Max Stamina. I need Max Stamina. That's how I hold up my Goku hair. Alright, let's head back and give him his... Do the delivery. Okay, so you've made it back to base camp. There's a precious little red box right ahead of you. <laughs> precious, indeed. Every base camp has a red delivery box. Now, hey. So, did you open the delivery box? Hmm, I wonder how he knew. Alright, so... You can deliver it right here by pressing A and then selecting the quantity. Right now, there's only one, so there you go. But say you don't want to do it that way. Say you're just like, boom, I'm going to roll up, and you're like, you know, wanting to be really super uber fast. Well, hopefully. You bam here. Not that this is even any faster, but you can actually just go to well done steak right there. And this deliver option shows up right there. Deliver it. Bam. Quantity, one. Would you like to deliver this item? Yes, mm, yes. Well done, steak delivered. And the main objective has been complete. There you go. Okay, yeah, it's pretty much the end, but we're just gonna wait for that. Quest complete. Hell yeah, I've completed my quest. Now if I could just have confirmation. There it is. Officially completed. But anyway, there you go. Fee. I guess there's a fee to enter some. That's the main reward. Anyway. There's the Zenny and then the White Academy points, but since I already completed this. Dang, the hiccups. Alright, let's just get on. Let's move on. Alright, 
let's just let's cut the video off right there